Hey, welcome to the Cone Zone. Um, I'm here to show you how to restring an acoustic guitar. Guitarings. So the first thing you gotta do is get rid of the old crusties. Get yourself some slack. And then uh, you could take them all off or just maybe do the low three, whatever you wanna do. Some people say it's good to leave uh, some tension on the neck. We'll just do three at a time for now. I have this little uh, Planet Waves tool. Um, it's a twiddly twister and a clippy clips. Get rid of the crappy strings. There's one other tool on this twisty, and it's right here. It's this little lip that you see in there. So that conveniently helps in plucking out the pegs in there. You go like this, lifts it right out. Now is a good chance to wipe off all of your disgusting sweat drying up and uh, getting all gnarly. So grab your strings. Kyle and I both use Diodarios because they're the best. String goes in the hole, ball end down. There's a little groove in the pin. So a little groove in the pin goes along, goes, it goes towards, faces towards the string. So like this is how it's gonna sit down in the hole. So it goes like this, string in, pin in, hold the pin down with your finger, pull the string up. It'll lock everything into place there, hopefully. Sometimes your pins will be a little looser, sometimes they'll be tighter. If they're a little looser, the pin might try to pull out a little bit. If it does, you start, you're gonna hold it down a little bit while you twist. Um, okay, so now we got this. We've got the, the pointy end that will penetrate you if you're not careful. I usually like to line up the, po the hole on the post. If you put the string through, the string will come out. Go like this, bring it through. Give yourself a little bit of slack over here. You know, sometimes it's maybe like this, probably a little less. You really just want like one wrap on your post. So here's how I do it. I go one wrap over the slack, over the excess string, I'm sorry. You can just bring it around, and then the other one will go under. That's one way to kind of get it to clamp down a little bit. See, all I really have there is it's about two, you know, two, one and a half to two wraps there. Go in, make sure your post post is down, locked in. Do a little stretch. Bring it up to pitch. Maybe you're one of those guys that's like, I like my strings to dangle off the top of my head stock. Um, I like to clip them clean. So I use this, clip it off. Then here's something that I do too. I don't like this sharp thing poking up. So I'll go in with my clipper and just, just force it down so that if I'm ever up there tuning or whatever, I don't get you know, stabbed, because that shit hurts. Not too much slack. You don't want too many wines on the uh, on the post. Just, just uh, one or two. Push down the little uh, sharp string tip that will inevitably cut you. And then just make sure you're stretching them out the whole way. They're gonna require a lot of stretching before they actually sit into tune and stay in tune nicely.